Hello everyone, my name is Beckham Wood and welcome back to YouTube on my channel. Um, today I'm going to be going over my experience with Assassin's Creed 3 Remastered. Let's start. I'm just gonna start right now. If you're new to the channel, my name is Beckham Wood. I do lots of gaming reviews and technology. So, if you're interested in that stuff, please consider subscribing. I would really appreciate it. So, Let's get into it. I just beat Assassin's Creed 3 today, not the epilogue yet, but like the main story. And it was really interesting and awesome. Um, I mean the graphical quality was not the best on a Switch. I know it's available on Xbox One, I'm not sure about PlayStation because I don't own one. But you could always check. Um, it's really awesome how it's like not real life half the story so pretty much you're you're a guy named desmond and you're controlling um people back in the animus is what it's called you're controlling people back in the 1700s i think is what it was um and pretty much you're supposed to stop um it's like of the revolution almost, so trying to stop Britain from taking over America. And there's a whole nother story to it, like a twist off, where you have to, like, there's power sources. You're in it, you're in an underground area, like the guy, <laughs> it's really confusing. The real life guy. He is controlling the guy in the 1700s. Pretty much they're trying to stop things that are going to happen, if that makes sense. Um, this is really fun on Nintendo Switch. Um, it's, it's just nice stuff, portable. It definitely drains the battery really quick. In an hour, you probably lose half on the old bottles. If you got one, 2019 and after um you won't have to deal with that um right now it still has not came for the game uh, bedroom but um i am taking use of the hdmi in on my xbox for my switch because then i don't have to deal with because there's only two hdmi ports back there so now i can just deal with having two or not, not having too much plugged in, so you know, we can have the switch plugged in to my Xbox, and I can just play it through my Xbox. There's a little bit of latency, but you can just play it on your own switch. I mean, you don't have to play through an Xbox or a PlayStation 4. But I really am wanting the table to come so the gaming bedroom can actually develop. So. Um, like I was saying, it definitely drains my battery really quick. I mean, probably spent an hour and a half playing it and I went down to like 40%. It's at 80 right now because I let it charge a little. But um, the controls are nice. I mean, it's move, look around, sprint. I mean, there's a couple other buttons dedicated. Um, I would warn you, there are some bloody scenes, um, cutscenes, you can skip most of them. There's a couple that you need to watch because it's critical to the story. Um, there are, yeah, there's a couple bloody things you definitely, you have to kill. So, you have to, you have to kill lots of people and attack people and, yeah. Um, it is a tough game. There's a lot of sections where it makes me really mad to be playing the game. Um, yeah, there's just a tough, really tough sections. I'd search up on YouTube what way to go on a couple sections. Um, it's definitely not as hard as like Brotherhood. Brotherhood is pretty tough, but it's just still a really hard game. And if I'm comparing it to like Syndicate, really good. 
So overall, this is a really awesome game. Um, I think I got it on sale for like 15 bucks, but if you see it out in the wild, I would definitely pick it up because it is worth your time. I think personally, I mean, I probably spent 20, 20 hours playing this. I mean, to finish it. I mean, I grind it pretty hard, though. I mean, I bet it takes around 25, maybe a little less. Well, I'm probably pretty average. But, um, after you finish, there's lots of stuff you can do. It's just like Zelda or Animal- I mean, Animal Crossing you can't beat. But there's so much more stuff you can do once you beat the game. And there's a lot of little mini stories in the epilogue that I haven't played yet. Mind you, I finished the game today, but if you can pick up the game, I would definitely check it out. It is a really fun game, and I will be seeing you guys next video. Goodbye.